Alright, so good afternoon everyone who's not watching this video. Uh, I've been busy all day today, <coughs> as uh, Christina always says. Uh, after I, whoopsie, after I finished recording my voice and everything, I went and uh, walked in uh, Frederick Stahl with my uh, maternal grandfather and watched two birds. We didn't see that many, but we did see a few, about uh, 15 species. And uh, then I played chess with them and I won three times in a row. We only played three times, so I have a 6 0 record with him, against him. And that's good. I mean, it's always fun when you win. That's the card games with my grandmother. Uh, so, we always play. Uh, I think it's jackass in English. <clears throat> and after I saw my grandfather, I went home and I put on my running gear and I went out running in Park Forest and I ran and then I took the AX raid in stride. And uh, then I continued running, then I came home, and then I just rode my bike for one and a half hours. And then I showered, and now I'm here, reapplying my makeup, because makeup, makeup tends to get a bit runny when you exercise so, as much as I do. <clears throat> and uh, I'm going to leave her to see this one because I have another EX raid and an ordinary raid. A chairman in 35 minutes. And it takes about 20 minutes to walk there, so I have to get finished with my makeup pretty soon. And uh, the meeting with my grandfather today was much better than last time. He didn't call me a shemail or anything, so that's a big plus. When you feel that you're accepted by someone. Of course, the person whose acceptance I still seek the most is my father's. But uh, that's never going to happen. I believe, unfortunately. He can say that he accepts me, but... Then the next second he just turns around and hurts me a lot. Not physically, of course, but uh, emotionally. He did hurt me physically in, in the past, but was sometimes related to me being a sissy according to him. But most of the time it was for other unrelated things. <clears throat> so I hope that if I exercise as much as I do today and uh, restrict my diet, I can perhaps shed a few pounds. I mean, this is hardcore exercise. It's abnormal to exercise as much as I do. So of course I'm going to gain a lot of muscle.
you don't have much uh, to say. Because, I mean, I recorded twice today. First my voice and first my makeup and my voice and now I'm doing another makeup video. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah, not much happens in such a short time span after I mean, I exercised a lot. And that's pr probably the most important thing in my life, exercise. I just wish that I had been born female and not had the issues that I had with uh, my body and uh, everything, you know, my knees and uh, a bad family and upbringing and everything, then I might have competed internationally because I had a lot of talent. But that's, the past is the past. I mean, once I've changed my legal gender, I can compete as a woman again. And if my body allows, I might start, I might get far again. I mean, <clears throat> I'm going to be 27 or so when I'm a woman, legally. And uh, then I'll still have about 10 years ahead of me in running because you can be at the world elite until you are about 35, 40. And uh, I mean, I've I had a lot of potential. As a man, but uh, things never were never meant to be, unfortunately. <clears throat> or I can't say as a man because I was never an adult when I ran because I finished my running career when I was 19 and that was still a boy I wouldn't say I'm sorry if I thought that I could change the world <laughs> Hiding the tears in my eyes, cause boys don't cry. <clears throat> boys don't cry. Dicks don't cry. Dicks don't cry.
some more rouge or blusher or whatever. <clears throat> now I'm just checking here and then I'm going to see if I can get this one. So it looks good, so I'm going to end here and say bye-bye.